The Argos have only run the football twice this afternoon. Dunnigan will throw again, this time to the pinball. He waits for Williams to make the block. Touchdown. I could not think of a better person uh, to lead this franchise going forward with the winning pedigree that he has, the ability to motivate, the ability to um, bring unity um, and, and to show the path forward than Pinball Clements. Hey, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. When I said, what's the word? You say it. Yeah. What's the word? Hey. What's the word? Hey. What's the word? Hey. Now listen, let's learn how to finish. Huh. Let's learn how to finish right down today. So when they score, when we score, we all are always, always, always set the tone. I am very pleased to introduce Pinball Clements, uh, as, as everyone affectionately calls him Pinball. Um, as our new general manager for the franchise. I can't tell you uh, how passionate I am about this team and this league and, and how passionate I am about uh, our fans. And uh, it is my goal uh, to do uh, my level best to make sure that we are not just a competitive team on a consistent basis, but we want to return to being a championship team. Is that me? Yeah. My phone is never on. Come, come, <laughs> click it off, click the button. It's never on. I don't know how that, yeah. My goodness. Wow, when I'm expecting a call is silent. What's up with that? Yes. <laughs> For us, we, we've had success here, right? Um, you know, I, I was told so many times when I first came, yeah, the Argonauts didn't win the Great Cup for like 31 years from like 1952 to 1983. And, and you know, I've been here one year less than that and we've won six times. So we've won the Great Cup. We've won the championship. The challenge is, is that we haven't been consistent in between. We've won the, tr the championship, I believe, as much as anybody in the last 30 years. I think Calgary equals us. Um, and, uh, but, but we haven't, though, um, been as consistent. And so that consistency is what we're driving at, right? Um, and if we're consistent often enough, right, that ultimately will turn to excellence. And some exciting players over the years in the Canadian Football League. But I tell you folks, you have to look long and hard to equal the accomplishments in 1990 of this man. All you need to say is from the Toronto Argonauts, the pinball Mike Clemens. Um, when, uh, when I think about Argonauts football, the, the very first thing I think about is relationship, right? Uh, it, it is... Uh, my, my first vision of coming here are, are those great guys that met me, right? Uh, when I walked through the door, uh, they um, thought I was misplaced. <laughs> they were like, obviously this is not the guy who's coming to play. And, uh, uh, but it's, it's, it's great. The very first time I touched the ball um, in a regular season game, I fumbled. And... Um, to a man, it felt like every player on that team came over to me and they patted me on the back and said, hey, listen, don't worry about that. We'll get it back. You're going to be fine. Right. And it felt like the whole it felt like every guy on the team came over to me. And by the end of the game, I was given the most outstanding player of the game award in that game. Right. But it could have went a, a, a totally different way. Right. You know, it could have been like, look at you, guy, you, you know, you just coming in here fumbling the ball and, and I could have lost my head and, right. Um, you know, this is, it, it really is creating that atmosphere where people honor each other, right? It starts there. Guys, I think of myself as a rational man. A guy who understands perspective about life and what's important. Part of it is this. It's when you truly care about somebody and you're willing to work together with them and you're really, truly willing to do it, not just for your own good, but for their good first. When you think about somebody,
somebody else first. They truly become family. Who are we? Family. Who are we? Family. Who are we? Family. Now, when we go out there today, we've been talking about playing at another level. We've been talking about being dominant. And you know why we've been dominant in the last few weeks? What's the word? Hey. What's the word? Because hey. you got to hit somebody in this game. That's why we've been dominant. Now, when we go out there today, there's going to be a bigger audience that's ever seen football in this entire country in history. It's the biggest crowd ever. Now we got a chance to do what we talked about. We talked about playing this game at a level that nobody, nobody, nobody in any league, anywhere has ever played this game. What's the word? What's the word? What's the word? What's the word? Now, when the guys are watching in Calgary today, when they're watching in Calgary today, I want them to call up and see the big line. Hey, listen, I've never seen anybody play the game like this. If I got a fight from Calgary, I'll do it. What's the word? What's the word? Guys, let's go out there today as a family and get it done from the first whistle to the last. Who are we? Who are we? Win on three. One, two, three. One thing that we asked of our guys is their best, right? And your best is always good enough, but your best should get better. Let me say that again. Your best is always good enough, but your best should get better. In other words, if you're giving your best all the time, you will improve. And that's what we plan on doing. We'll be a better team.